Hi, come here. I would like to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. Buddy, welcome back to another video. And today we are playing more God of War Ragnarok. And uh, I know this is going up kind of late, but uh, hope you guys had a good Christmas. So uh, yeah, let's uh, let's keep going, shall we? We're gonna go with the actual missions this time because. In order to get some more stuff for the blades and the axe. Father, do you ever what? wonder if you're doing the right thing? No. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, cool. But, uh, yeah. So, we need to do the main mission. So, we need to go back to Vanaheim. And I'm guessing that's... That's when we now, get Skull and Hottie we back to do this. Details of a prophecy can wreak havoc on the believers. Back in my homeland, I was privy to the operations of a certain coven of heath witches who are keen on destabilizing the government. Yeah. I picked an influential thane, an otherwise loyal man, and fed him a story of his own ascension to king. They dressed it up in enough details they knew would come to pass, so when they did. The Thane took it as confirmation. Next thing you know, he's helping matters along. He murders his king, sleeping under his own roof. Murders many he once called friends, too, thinking them fated to oppose him. Then, for a finishing touch, the witches revisit this usurper. With just a few details structured ever so misleadingly, they convinced the fool he was invulnerable to all threats. Physical or magical. Aye, aye. But twas not so for him. All turned into a rather magnificent bloodbath as they go. The Thane ends up without his head and a name so cursed, none dare speak it. All thanks to a subtly deceptive prophecy. You really gotta write these stories down one day, Mimir. Well, I try. Jaw tends to get sore, but thank you <laughs> I mean, Mamir does try. So, let's continue, shall we? Alright, oh, and before I forget, um, you know, my, the GPU stuff has still not gotten fixed. So, we're gonna have to do this off my PlayStation for the time being. So. Alright, let's go. Great. Are you gonna check in on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. All right, here we go, Vanaheim so again. What happened the last time you were in Vanaheim? I still don't know how you got Frey to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freyr's camp. You met Freyr? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. <laughs> But he's a bit quicker to forget. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's oh. in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Okay. So he throws the axe differently. Depending on the button you hold down. Alright. I'll take that. Okay, now we just need... Oh, there it is. There's the door. Alright, let's go see what stuff is in what stuff we're doing in Vanaheim, wow. shall we? It's beautiful. And uh wet. It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? I mean, he's got a point. Hold on, let's take off let's take off this favor. The Elven Sanctum, untrack. I mean we could do that, but uh, I, I, let's get part of the story done first before we even try and tackle tackle it Freya's again. To the right. No rush is that? Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. You know what? True. True. All right. So, um, yeah. Uh, well, we do need to progress in order to get... I'm sure it's fine to check in on Freya later. I don't quite think it was. Alright. 
Okay, so, Vanaheim. Um, impressions, again, after being gone for so long, um, it's actually still a beautiful place, so. I didn't think there were boats <laughs> to travel with, so, uh, I guess that's different. So, uh, is there a, is there a dock anywhere? I'm guessing not. What's this? Oh, it's a bridge. With a realm tear. That can only mean one thing. We have to go check out the realm tear. Ooh, what's this thing? What is this thing? Ah, now I know what it is. Alright, let's go. Yeah, yeah, no. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. Ow, I was hoping for another realm shift. But that's alright. Hey, no. Oh, that. Alright. I need to hit that. If I want to actually heal some damage. Oh, there's another one. Okay, let's go then. Ow. We need to cool him down. I got just the thing. Ooh. Okay, okay. Okay then. I'll take it. A lot of creatures. Nature really took this place back, huh? Alright, let's see what's a ooh. I don't like this. This mentions a spell that puts trolls to sleep, and a magic relic that acts as a sort of counter spell. I don't like this. I I I don't. Oh, why you can't even find the runes no more? That's dumb. A little bit. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, hey. Like more of Lunda's old armor. Lunda's broken brace. Go away. And what's the point of this? That's my question. I mean, I guess we can just. Well, we can break this by doing that. And the poison dispel? Look, the garden's regrowing. Okay. I I don't know what that did, but it 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 did something. Uh let's... this desolation a fitting fate. Who's talking? Oh you. Okay. Spirit. Have you come to Cedar Garden? Yes. No. Of course not. And you can't. Not since the Ainhar poisoned it. My life's work. A gift of love to the goddess Freya. We know Freya too. She's a friend of ours. I swore to keep this garden in bloom until she returned. Now I live forever amongst its putrescence. A just punishment for my failure. Father, 
Maybe we should get rid of those poison totems. I agree with you. This is pointless. There doesn't have to be a point other than just doing something nice for somebody. Besides, Frey would appreciate us helping out her people. I wonder what happens. Like, can we throw it at it? Yeah, we can. Alright, obviously we just can't explode it ourselves. So. Nope, that still doesn't. Hey, who are you throwing stuff at? Calm yourself. Oh, hi. Okay. What's this? Huh? What, what, what is this? Is there a way inside up there? I don't know. Yes. Yes, there is. Um. There's that, so. Ooh, thank you. I'll take this, thank you. Let me, let me see what's in here. Uh, just dwarven steel, alright. I'll take it, I guess. Well, we do need to craft that pair of armor. Well, that Find those there. bracers. We are at war. Fun does not enter into it. Well, that's clearly a lie. We need to destroy that. So, uh, is there a way we could get it from here? No, I don't see a way. Yeah, I do. That Frey would be glad we're getting into these. Okay. Two out of three totems have been destroyed. I need to destroy this one. But well, where is? Well, let me throw that there. there. That bomb should help us out. Ah, maybe you can hit it from a different angle. You know what? I never thought of that. Hold on. Let me see. Yeah, we need to be at a different angle in order to. Hit it. Should we be up there? I wonder. Oh, we could pop. Yeah. Oh, let me let me go up there real quick. Yeah, let me go up there. Uh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, definitely. I just need to aim it right. Boom. All right, down we go. Let's let's do this and then we can continue on. The land. It's alive again. I can feel it. Yes. Your garden grows again. How did you Now that your garden is restored and all, you can, you know, move on if you want. You've made it so I can. Oh, thank you, stranger. You've done more than you know. All right. Oh, you've done a great kindness. Okay. A temporary one. The garden will die again. I think Frey would still appreciate it. She sure would. Okay. I'm not going to go after that realm here. So. All right. Let's uh let's go back to uh Frey's camp and I'll see you guys there. It'll be Camp then. Time to see how the Vanier have fared in our absence. I hope Freya is okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her though. Her brother's forces are outnumbered, and there is much I owe her. All right. Well, glad we're here though. So, I kind of like this armor that I currently have on. It's just I want to try out Lunda's armor, you know. <laughs> no, Kratos. All right, hold on. I'm going to have to jump back and There we go. 
<laughs> That's actually kind of cool how we just we have well we can't pull out weapons. So Alright. I'll take that as a uh as a gesture. Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. Alright. No one here. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. Huh? Who's there? Who is there, huh? Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man, or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, tish-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? Hildes Vini. Hmm. Remember when okay. we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh. I am so, so sorry about that. Freya's poor. Her advisor. And friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. Okay, let's continue then. We can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Okay, well, I'm just going to take whatever's in here. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, let's go. Freya. She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Big Veer. They've been captured by the Ainher Yard. Hey, that happened. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters nice. worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy. Tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just mm. up in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skull and Hati, he'd be a fellow giant. Very well. We can't go this way. So. Now there's two pathways we can take. We can go that way. Or we can go that way. I'm choosing the latter. This place has already been ransacked. Get out of here. Oh, I can't destroy that. Alright. Cool. All right, we're going this way. We can't go this way. I was lied to. I've been, we've been shammed. Um, oh. Don't disappoint. Continue down this path, and you'll find their den. Good luck. All right. And don't shoot any boars. <laughs> I think he's really forgiven me for shooting him. Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. I'm on guard for the poison and poison thingies. All well and good. 
Let Sula's privacy, huh? Okay, okay. Point taken. <laughs> Oh, let's go. Where? I knew it. All right. Well, at least we're making some progress. Since you're here on my terms, I suppose it would be great if you would let us pass. Oh, okay then. Alright, cool. That worked, surprisingly. Dang. How many of those she spawned? I need to wait for them to respawn. Okay. I would gladly appreciate it if you didn't keep shooting your arrows at Thank you. Ooh. Thanks. We need to take care of these. Alright. Oh, let me uh, let me grab these real quick. Yeah, I will. I don't know what you're talking about. Anaheim looks and feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Svartalfan, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh, what? Egros. Greek. For humid. Egros. I like it. Alright, uh, where do we go now? Over here. Okay. Alright. Uh, no. Cool. The milk is making these things stronger! What's making them stronger? No, you don't get to do that. You don't get to make that kind of decision. But you, on the other hand. Oh, hey. Oh. Go away. Dang. No, you come here. Sorry, I have to activate them because it looks so great. I don't know why. Wonder where they went. Eaten by a knocking, perhaps. Doubtful. You know, I mean, this excursion into Vanaheim means you've now visited each of the nine realms. Huh? I guess you're right. 
Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. <laughs> I think we... Oh, does Vini said both Frey and Big Vir were captured? Big Vir's the light elf who wanted to learn more about that library in Alfheim, right? Correct. An exiled scholar married to a warrior, Bela. Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. But I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. Well, that raises even more questions. He's okay. All right, let's keep going. Oh, hey, what's this? Oh, I knew it. You ain't gonna get a drop on me today. Uh-uh, I refuse. <laughs> let me have, let me have this. No. Man, you keep throwing poison at me. We about to have problems. Come here. All right, listen. Yeah, the note is making it stronger. Found you. Hey, man. Hey, what's what, good, homie? Let's go, bro. Hey, what's this? Oh, an As Asgardian ingot? Let's go. Alright. Let's go find, uh, let's go find... Let's go find those two troublemakers now. Let's see. What's in here, though? <laughs> what's here? Oh, it's a Nornier chest. Crap. Hi, come here. I would like to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. No. Again, I would like to talk to you about your car's extended warranty, sir. Thank you. Okay, so. Amir, you once told us Ragnarok begins when Skull and Hati catch the sun and moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. Prophecy. Which, after our time with the Norns, we've all had quite enough of. But Odin still believes. That's gotta be why the Einar Yar stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnarok. Or he prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract his enemies. Yeah, or that, I guess. Is one of them gone? Oh, no, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me do it again. Oh, I missed. Alright. Cool. Oh, which one was it? Right there. Okay. Cool, that's one. I saw a second one earlier. Hey. I see that. Don't even. Okay, yeah, I see. I see that one. And I have. And there's another one right here. Uh, okay. And it's this one. No, it's not that one. It's this one. Let's go. All right. Can we find the third one? That is my question. 
Oh, the third one's right here. Can I reach it with my blade? Is the question. Boom. Got it. Oh, it's a horn of blood mead. Let's go, bro. I have two out of three. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay, cool. I can sense them up there. It's gotta be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hattie, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. Exactly. <laughs> there they are. Uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right, well, guess we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? Yep. If that's a perfectly normal thing to say. Alright, well, if you guys like this video, then make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys at the, in the next video.